This is the part where I slap you. Go ahead. I deserve it. Stop, stop, stop. We can't do this. Why not? Okay, yeah, there's that, but I mean, it's, it's not too late to end things, babe. Jimmy, why did you kiss me? Because... I still have to decide if I want to go through with things. And? And I regret not kissing you sooner. I regret being so afraid of risking our 12-year relationship. I regret attempting to love someone else. I regret sitting on the sidelines quietly watching weak men fail to give you the love you deserve. Most of all, I regret me and Amma. I never meant for things to get this far. That word again. What word? Things. Melissa. Jimmy, the things you keep referring to is a wedding and a relationship with my sister. Tell me not to do it. Do what? Tell me you and I are real. Tell me you feel the same, babe. Then what? Then I go out there and tell I mind everyone else that you're the one I love. That the wedding is off. You wouldn't. Dear me. Tell me you love me. You're confused. Period, didn't you tell us? No. Your bride to be sent me to fetch you. Dinner is served, everyone is here, so. So let me get things straight. You intentionally drove your car into a tree, broke your arm, and almost suffered a concussion because you didn't want to attend the wedding. Not just any wedding. It's the wedding of the man I love, and he's about... <laughs> you rich girls kill me. I'm not rich. But you wrecked a perfectly good car. Yeah, sure, you're right. You're not rich. You're crazy. You don't understand. I'm expected to be at this wedding. Literally, every single person I know is going to be in attendance. I needed the perfect excuse not to be there. So, the solution was to kill yourself? I'm not trying to kill myself. I'm trying to avoid looking like the bitter single woman. So, a false image is of more importance to you than expressing how you truly feel? Like I said, you don't understand. Okay, let's see. The man you claim to love is about to make what you claim is the biggest mistake of his life. And you're willing to let him because you want to save face and stay miserable. So you do understand? Sure, I understand. Cowardly behavior is easy to understand. I am not a coward. I see. Please, tilt your head this way for me, please. I'm really not a coward, you know. Am I? Oh my gosh, I'm totally being a coward. But that's not me, I'm not a coward. I am strong, I'm confident. I'm in love. I'm in love. Ow. What do you think you're doing? I still have time to make things right. The final wedding rehearsal is in a few. I can't stop things before they go any further. I'm not done with treating your bruises. <sighs> Doctor, you've done more than enough. <laughs> you've saved me from a lifetime of loneliness. <sighs> you should totally consider becoming a life coach. <sighs> Wait! Oh. Poor girl. 
she'll be back with more bruises. The bride and the bridegroom have vows we have to declare now. Thank you, Pastor. Amen. From the moment I laid my eyes on you. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Come here. Uh. Hello, guys. You know, we have to hasten up. We have just 10 more minutes to go. Yeah, almost done. Okay, um, let us go on a break now. We've been at this all morning. And That's please, fine. has anyone been able to reach mom? Has she been able to reach Melissa? She's supposed to be my bridesmaid. Why isn't she here now? Don't worry. I'll call your mom, okay? Melissa? Where the hell have you been? I have been trying to reach you all morning. What happened to you? Mel, what are you doing? I'm so sorry. Jimmy. I love you. Jesus! I'm so sorry it took me so long to figure it out, but it's real. You and I are real. Hang on, Emma. Let him sort it out. What, no. what, what is this? Relax. Mel, what is this? Relax, Emma. Mel, Come Jimmy. Here. No, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let, let him sort it out. Emma, Emma, come on. Leave me, Daddy. Come. Melissa, I can't. What? Look, you were right. I, I was confused. It must have been pre-wedding jitters or something. I love you. I love your sister. And listen, look, I love you. I love you too. But as a friend, I'm sorry. <laughs> 